vegetable oil, widely used in cooking, frying and typically discarded after its use. But at Tapera Industries in Lusaka, Zambia, old oil gets a new purpose. We are a business that uh, focuses on the production of uh, biofuels and uh, we also produce natural soap products. Mutoba Ungoma purchases used vegetable oil and converts it to fuel for cars and machinery. He says the business generates $15,000 a month. The inspiration to pursue alternative energy came unexpectedly in 2006. I just completed my schooling in the UK in aeronautical engineering and uh, I came across a program about renewable energy in Brazil. At the same time, uh, Zambia was going through a problem of uh, fuel shortages. Ngoma got a loan from his father and launched his business that very year. That time we were backyard startup doing about 200 liters per month. Right now we're doing uh, 3,000 liters a month. So this is how we clean the used cooking oil after it comes from the restaurants. Motoba says he designed his own processing machines and is building his clientele. We've got one major client that takes uh, the bulk of what we produce and then we've got about seven or eight uh, small clients that come in for small quantities. We have also diversified our product range. We're not only doing biodiesel, we're also doing organic soaps. The idea of making soaps came about as a result of one of our challenges of securing enough uh, raw material for the diesel. We realized that as we were waiting for more oil to come about, we could actually be producing something else and we found that we could actually produce uh, soap from the same oil. So we just had to clean it a bit more and then it's even cheaper to process than the diesel. We stuck with it because we felt that it's also a good income generator. But his focus remains on growing the biofuel side of his business. We are working on uh, securing uh, financing so that we can increase our capacity, our production rate and also the raw material base. We want to set up in a bigger facility and through that we hope that we can expand to where we intend to be.